welcome back to the channel guys. I know it's been a while since I've posted something, but uh, I've been a little bit busy. Work's been a little bit hectic and uh, the car's been uh, in and out of the shop uh, just due to doing the brake and service and a few other little minor things for, uh, you know, protecting the investment. So today's video is going to be focused on uh, one of my pet peeves, which is you pay so much money for a car and automakers skip corners especially when it comes to this thing i mean you're paying good money for it and bmw gives you this nice aluminum dead pedal but they can't you know add in these suckers over here so i went off and got me some genuine and performance aluminum pedals when it comes for the M2 competition, uh, the packaging is going to bring the other pedals also for the, uh, if it was a uh, manual. So it comes with your two aluminum pedals, your accelerator pedal, your two rubber boots for the uh, brake and also the clutch and your hardware. Uh, the little bolts are a 7 millimeter, and the uh, screws are a Torx. And without further ado, let's uh, go ahead and do this install. The install of the gas pedal is actually uh, pretty straightforward. You have double-sided sticky tape, so you'll clean off the pedal off. Peel this off, place it on there, but to secure it, you're going to have to drill here and here, and there's two screws that are actually very distinct in the pattern compared to the other ones on the thread pitch. So you'll drill in here, go slightly smaller. So then this will go in tight. Here to know what boot to use, you're gonna notice that they have this thicker portion. If you feel here, you're gonna see that this has the thicker portion. Also, you're gonna have to peel this off. So that's where you'll grab and pull off. Just to expose the bare metal. So as you can see, so it'll go in this way. Now out here, we're gonna have to do a little bit more drilling. Uh, so you'll slide this on. And what I like to do is actually mark the area and then remove the boot, drill through, and then install everything back on. 